Hello, everybody. I am doing my eating show, which I just put the last of the meat. It's almost done cooking. Um, I've got mushrooms and some garlic. Um, I have more garlic on that side, but I, I can only handle one clove of garlic before I gag. But I've got my kalbi here that I've already cooked. And then I've got my Napa cabbage kimchi, which is right here. And then I have my, my spinach, Korean spinach. And then I have my mung bean sprouts. It's that right there. And then I have my Korean pickles. And then I have my radish salad, just right here. You can see that. And then I also have, I tried to make um, Korean scallion pancakes. This is what's left. I've eaten half of it already. Um, and then I've got right here, I have my multi-grain rice. Ooh, that's hot. Oh, that's hot. That's really, really hot. I've got my multi-grain rice right there. And then um, I have my plum wine, which I can't remember the brand of plum wine I ate when I was in Korea, but it tastes a lot sweeter than this. And it was a lot more potent. Like I only, like they would serve the plum wine in these really tiny shot glasses. And like three of those would get me like totally wasted. But, ooh, let me turn my meat here. All right, that's the not. And how is the doing? Okay. Another mushroom in there. Yeah, hopefully the smoke alarm won't go off because it's kind of smoky in here. I don't know how to... I can't seem to cook without making a huge mess out of everything. Look at the last of my mushroom on the grill there. And I guess I can start assembling my first little thing of yumminess. So I've got red leaf lettuce. We don't have, I can't find perilla leaves where I live, so I have to make do with what I can. I should have got the red butter leaves, but Hindsight is 2020. I got my piece of kalbi. And then I've got my sesame oil right there. And then I have a little bit of cabbage kimchi. Ooh. Somebody doesn't want to come off the jaw here. All right. And then some mung bean sprouts. Kimchi. Make some spinach. Blah, 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 blah. All right. Fold this up and then shove it in my mouth. Hmm. 
think next time I'm going to get the butter leaf lettuce. And then shot of plum wine. Oh, that's really sweet. All right. Let's do a smaller lettuce wrap this time because that was way too much to handle. Way too much for me. It's a small piece of meat. There. And then the radish. And the pickle. A couple of pickles. Hmm. That's done. Oh, saving the meat. No, it's just easier to hold with this. I'm gonna save my bones for later. That's what I'm gonna nibble on while I'm watching my movie. Oh, excuse me. Excuse me for burping.
to have any more mushrooms. Nope, that's the last of the mushrooms. Bummer. Okay. So another leaf. Oops. All right. Bam. Um, mushroom. Oh, that's got juices in it. Uh oh. Uh oh. Oh, it's got juices. Hot! Oh, that's hot. That's hot. That's hot. That's hot. That's hot. And I need some crunch. There we go. Mm. <laughs> that was a really good mushroom. Starting to juice. I don't know if that one will. Mm. That mushroom juice is so good. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Oh, give me a leaf. Worst idea ever. I will never use red leaf lettuce again. Oh, that's a hot mushroom. Ooh, yeah. Oh, that's hot. Okay. Ready. Ready, set, go. Oh, oh that's hot. Mm. That's really hot. Make sure that puppy is nice and cooked because I do not, I really don't like garlic. Not gonna work. Why can't they make chopsticks like this? Yeah, uh, come on. There we go. Now he's gonna cook. Okay. 
still very hot. Uh -huh. Hmm. Hmm. Ah, did juice. And go figure. I left my napkins way over there. Yay. Mm. Enjoy this while I can. Mm. That's very fresh. Mm. Oh. This thing is cooked, cooked to perfection. Look right here, like the best sauce for the meat. It's just salt, pepper, and sesame oil. It's really good. I wonder what that tastes like. Mm -hmm. Let's find a piece of lettuce. Okay. So I got my lettuce. And then I have my meat. And I've got my garlic. Oh. <laughs> Wish me luck there with a bath. A whole clove of garlic. This will be the only garlic I'll eat besides what's in all this stuff right here. But. Ooh. Garlic isn't so bad when it's been roasted. That was actually really good. I don't know about this big piece. Never catch me eating raw garlic. But putting this all together was kind of a long process because I I've been up since eleven o'clock last night. Getting all the side dishes ready. And I get the spinach, the mung bean sprouts, and the 
the pickles this morning. And then um, I started prepping for the Korean scallion pancake, which Mm. Hmm. Be right in my lap. All right, my last piece of meat. Save my bones for later. And then Now, all I have left are my mushrooms, and that's it. I guess I can turn this off. That's going to be a beast to cook later on. Oh, excuse me. I keep burping. All right. <clears throat> mm, now what do I want to eat? Let's get some more of this Korean scallion pancake. I put scallops and shrimp in this pancake. Oops. Piece of seafood in there. I don't really like that. Oh, I'm going to get wasted. Okay, so let's take the mushroom off and let it cool off a little bit. Actually, that can go a little longer.
My Colby. When all of these side dishes are gone, and my, my scallion and then my meat, I'm saving my bones for later because I'm planning on watching a couple of movies on TV and then the bones, the bones right here, this is what I'm going to nibble on because I actually like the connective tissue and the whatever you call that. They'll be so clean. It looks like they got bleached by the sun. Come on. Cheers. Hmm.
Mm -hmm. Epic fail. I'm supposed to be telling you how or when I was supposed to. Oh, I can't even think. I don't normally drink. So this plum wine is really getting to me. But <clears throat> when I was about six or seven years old, my my dad's friend invited our family over to their house for some barbecue. I thought it was going to be the standard fare, you know, American kind of barbecue, but my dad's friend's wife was Korean, so we had Korean barbecue, and we had um, we had kalbi. And then we had uh, mung, we had bean sprouts. I don't know if it was soy bean or mung beans, but back then I wasn't allergic to food the way I am now. And then we had some radish kimchi, and then cabbage kimchi, and then um, there was a bunch of like there was cucumber kimchi there too. I remember that. But I remember oh, and we had like white sticky rice. And my family. Prior to that, when we made rice, it was kind of watery, and then we would add sugar and butter to the rice, but this was, it was like white sticky rice, and it was naturally sweet. You didn't have to add anything to it, and that was the first time I ever had like white sticky rice. Hmm. Ever since I had my rice that way, I haven't been able to go back to the watery, sugary, buttery stuff. I prefer my rice, my rice sticky. I have, um, white cow rose rice mixed with, this is a cup of white cow rose rice mixed with a tablespoon of black rice. So that's why it has like this purple color to it. Let's see it up close. Hopefully I'm not, you're not getting a kick out of watching me with chopsticks. Let's see, this is the color. See, nice and kind of purpley. Mm. That's really good rice. Mm -hmm. I think my other pieces of mushrooms are done. I feel like I've been eating because I actually ate a couple of scallion pancakes before I even started. They set everything up. The first pancake is always a nightmare. It falls apart and I guess I have a little bit of it left on that side over there, but I put the prettiest pancakes right here so that you wouldn't get grossed out by my cooking. And then I'm actually almost full. Oh, 
grain of rice. Yay. There we go. Let that cool off. Hmm. What is this? Sake with natural plum flavor. From the house of Gi Kai Ken Kobe Plum. Gi Kai Ken Kobe Plum is light and refreshing with a delectable plum flavor. And produced and bottled by, oh, huh, Folsom, California. <laughs> That's the plum wine that I'm drinking right now. Pretty understandable. Oh. I guess I better turn this off. There we go. Let's see here. Oh, I don't know if you've noticed, but I'm not very skillful at chopsticks. When I lived in Korea, my roommate and I, um, we went to a Kalbi house and the waitress there She didn't like the way I was holding my chopsticks, which my which is weird because my roommate is even worse with her chopsticks than I was, but she saw me hold my chopsticks and then she yanks them out of my hand and starts yelling at me in Korean. And everybody in the restaurant knows what she's saying except for me and my roommate because neither one of us speak Korean. And She takes my hand, opens it up, and starts to put the chopsticks in there the way they're supposed to be held. And then she's yelling all these other things at me. And of course, everyone else in the restaurant understands what she's saying, except for me and my roommate, because we don't speak Korean. And they're laughing at us and looking at us. And it's hard to feel like embarrassed by what's going on, because I have no idea what this woman is saying to me. But anyway, I learned that day how to hold chopsticks. I can't say I've improved since then because it's either this plum wine that I'm drinking that has got me unable to hold them correctly or I just can't hold them correctly at all. Whew. I am actually... I'm actually very sleepy and I have been up for 12 hours. I'll probably go to sleep around noon and then wake up at eight and then clean the kitchen.
because this is quite a mess. I got to clean all these little dishes right here. I have quite a mess to clean up. I sliced those pretty thin. I did that all with a knife. This really isn't that much food. That was good. That was very, very good. Hmm. Hmm. 
40 minutes. Better lay off the alcohol because I'm starting to not feel like myself. <sighs> I hope this isn't something I'm going to regret. Hmm. Let's see what's on Instagram. Oh, I'm trying to take a picture, picture of Instagram. None of my stuff is close together. Let's put you close together there. All right. Radish salad. Oh, I can't type when I'm drunk. Really pickles. Pickles. Mung bean. Sprouts. Egg. Spinach. LA Calby. Oh, I can't type. Whoa. Take out. All right. Mung cheese, real mung cheese. All right. Oh, that's not attractive. Oh, it automatically turned off. Look at that. Okay. So we're going to do another Colby. 
um, call the okay. garlic. Eating that much garlic is going to guarantee I'll be single forever. Ah, garlic breath. Everything that you see here has garlic in it. Except for the scallion pancakes. That doesn't have garlic. But it does have onion. Green onions to be exact. So, all right. So let's put this in my mouth. Hmm. You ever get sick of chewing? That's what I feel like right now. I just want to put my food in a blender and sip it from a straw. Now, the recipes that for a lot of the stuff that I have right now, the marinade for the meat, that came from this cookbook. And then the recipe for the Korean spinach, mung bean sprouts, and the pickles, and then the Korean seafood scallion pancakes came from this book right here. Woo. I don't know if you can see that from these two books right here. Awesome cookbooks. Mm, what is that? Mm, piece of lettuce. Anyway, I'm very, very tired right now. And I just want to go to sleep. So... I'm just going to have to finish all this food another day. And with that, I am going to call this a day and then just put everything away. So thank you for watching. And if you'd like to see more of this, subscribe. Leave comments in the comment box, and I'll see you again. Goodbye. How do I stop this? Where's my mouse? Uh -huh. Bye.